Welcome back to the armor lock and security heat number one for KA4 Junior and the K and the 4SS Junior cart will be starting with them. You'll hear one four-stroke amongst them. So on track will be Evans and Egan from the front. Kerrin and Phillips, second row. Laycock Shepherd, third row. Rolfo Line, fourth row. Wooler and Evans. Then it'll be Newton and Tennant. Lockett and Munro. Collins and Cowie. Baker and Haddon. Rudd and Haddon. Simpson and Hume. And then Alfred off the back. Remember, random grid. And this is a huge 24 car field with the one 4SS cart off the back of Jordan McNamara. And round we come. We will start to form it up. I think they'll go long course from the pole though. Target and Evans. If this timing system is right, of course, we'll wait and see. I'm not sure how this my laps works just yet. But we'll look at when they come, because that's definitely Kyle Evans on the front with the number 16 of Egan alongside him. So I'm thinking that's how they're starting. Timing still says target off the front with me, but I don't know until they get round down that back straight. We'll see who's going to start where. We may just have to go with the flow. That's very definitely Evans and Egan off the front at the moment. Round we come then. A huge field. That's the 27. Just catching up off the back there. That looks like the uh, Henry Shepherd. Still not got his uh, position, so we'll have one more formation lap for these guys to do. Let's just check on numbers. Evans from Egan on the front. Then it is Perrin. And what looks like Phillips, I think, there. Target is up there with that traditional white helmet with the big blue stripe right down the guts of it as they all head to into the flip flop. Round we come then. And that is the number 35 of Byron Phillips on the second row as they all head down to Crane Hotline we should get a start this time just got one cart on the back to catch up still we're almost ready for a go round they come KA4 Juniors and 4SS down to DTE, getting ready for a start this time. Down the back straight, all formed up. We should get going this time. Evans and Egan, what will they do? Through Howard's gingerly. We've still got that one cart off the back who doesn't seem to be able to catch them up. I think we could just get going this time. Orange lights are indeed on. We should go racing this time. Who will get the whole shot? Will Evans get it? Will it be Egan? Green light racing. And it's all a huge plume of mist behind. That must be terrible being in the mid pack. But it is Egan, I think, that's got the whole shot. It is the number 16, Hayden Egan, to the front from Evans. Target up to third. Round we go through Crane Hotline into the Speed Bowl for the first time. Back up towards us at Patrese's. Egan's got his head down. Target up to second already. Target goes through. He's just gone past Evans. Can Evans get back? Target holds on. Down the back straight they go then. Phillips is right up there as well. On we go, down towards Howard, target to the front, target, he takes the lead from Egan, Egan hangs on to second, still Evans in third, Phillips looks like he's in fourth, over the line they come, it is target, holding on from Egan, and it's Evans, Phillips, Kevin, Kerrin, Newton, up to fifth, 
sorry, then it's Rolfo, Laycock, Line. Followed by Lockett, Collins, Buller, Evans, Baker, Cowie, and it all. Oh, he's gone round, the leader, Target. He's gone round in the chain break corner as the new leader, Evans. But he's going to have Tennant right with him in a minute. Tennant's just gone past Egan. Egan looks over his shoulder to see who's next. Into DTE they go. He's still hanging on. Down the back straight. Evans has now got the absolutely flying number 57 of Curtis Tennant. Breathing all over the back of him. Side by side. Into 12. Tries to cut back. Curtis Tennant right behind Evans. Will he go left? Will he go right? Through the kink he goes. Hangs on. Evans takes the inside. But he's got the comeback. Tennant to the front. Tennant's got the lead now. Bar. He's got a back marker in front. Who's having all sorts of traumas. Can they all get past cleanly? Blue lights will be waving. As he pulls over and lets them all through. That's a good move. Round we come then. Tennant, the new leader. Evans has been taken again. That's Newton. Newton is up there as well. Newton now right behind Evans. Will he get through a DTE? Yes, he does. Up to second. The flying Ryan Newton. Phillips is right there with them. It is on for young and old at the front. Round comes Tennant, the leader. Newton right with him. Oh, Evans almost cut his nose off. And that's brought Phillips right with him. Over the line they go. And it's Byron Phillips right there with Evans. Through two. On to three they go. It is Tennant, Newton, Evans, Phillips, Kerrin, Egan, Laycock, Lockett, Collins, Line, Evans, Cowie. Wooler, Target, Haddon, Haddon, Hume, Baker, Rolfo, Sampson, Alford, Rudd, Shepard and Jack Munro. Followed by McNamara in the 51, the 4SS. As they all stream down to DTE. Tennant looks like he's having this all his own way. Down to Howard he goes. Can Newton... Close that gap. It's 0.713 last time round. Evans is hanging on to third. Phillips has got some serious attention from Joshua Kerrin. Kerrin is right there. Will he look left? Will he look right? He's gone right around the outside. Kerrin, what a drive from Joshua Kerrin. He took the outside line up the kick. He is absolutely on the charge. Evans will be his next victim. Through goes to number 11. Phillips hangs on. Through Crane Hotline they go. It is all on behind. Lockett, Laycock, Collins and Cowie. Look at them all locked together. Will Kerry get Evans? Through Patrizis. Down to DTE. Down they go then through DTE. The leaders are already onto the back straight. And Newton, it's now 0.830 between himself and the leader, Curtis Tennant. Tennant through 12, onto 13, and Evans, he's got all sorts of dramas. Kerrin goes through. Kerrin up to third. Look at the drive from that number 11. He is absolutely on the charge. Joshua Kerrin, he is one fast driver today. Evans and Phillips, side by side. Evans just gets it done. Phillips has to yield behind. It is Blake Lockett, the Rocket. He's on the charge as well. Can the Rocket there? Hayden Egan hanging on to seven as they all go through Patrizzi's down to DTE. The leaders are already in. Tennant hanging on from Newton. Point four zero nine. He is closing, closing, closing. Into Howard he goes. Tennant just hanging on. Tennant, Newton, Perrin, Evans, Lockett, Phillips, Lockett, Egan, Collins, Cowie. Up to ninth. Then it's Laycock. Evans line tight. 
target, Muller, Hayden, Baker, Rolfo, then it's Hayden, Alford, Samson, Rudd, Hume, Shepard and Monroe, back with the leaders, and it's all come together, Newton, loving the conditions, Tedder was really quick here yesterday, he is looking really fast now, and can he hang on? Lap number six, Tenon goes through Patrese's, just hanging on from the flying number six of Ryan Newton and Evans. He's still in a huge battle with Phillips down to DTE, almost locked together yet again. The leaders though are already into pack markers, two stranded Carson Howard looking on as the leaders come through to complete Lap number seven, the leader, Tennant from Newton. Can he hang on? This is the last lap through the kick. Karen hangs on to third. Phillips is holding it fourth. Then it's Evans in fifth. But we'll watch the leaders go through chain break. Newton, desperate. Can he get past Tennant? Round they go through the speed ball up towards Patrese's back markers to contend with down towards DTE for the last time who will get the win will it be Newton or can Tennant hang on down the back straight they go for the last time Tennant he looks like he could hang on but there are back markers through Howard he goes into 12 for the last time checkered flag is about to come out They've got to negotiate back markers, but your winner, Curtis Tennant. Second, Ryan Newton. Third, Joshua Karen. Fourth, Byron Phillips. Fifth, Kyle Evans. Sixth, what a drive, Lachlan Cowie. Seventh, Target. Eighth was Laycock. Ninth was Line. 10th was Cody Collins, 11th, Blake the Rocket Locket, 12th was Wooler, 13th Rolfo, then it was Egan, followed by Haddon and Haddon, then it was Alford, followed by Ursula Evans, then it was Chad Stampson. Melania Rudd gets 20th. And there's some P-platers still that come through. I think those are the ones that are stranded down the far end. But what a race from the KA4 Juniors first up. And well done to Curtis Tennant on the win.